Two G's. Hi, I'm Corey. And I'm Colin. And welcome to this special edition of Two Teens. And two movies. We'll be reviewing two movies directed by our all-time favorite director, Steven Spielberg. The first movie that we'll be reviewing today is Tintin. Tintin is Steven Spielberg's first animated feature film. It's a story about an extraordinary Belgian reporter named Tintin who discovers a clue inside a model of a ship that could lead to the treasure of the sunken unicorn. He and his dog Snowy team up with Captain Haddock to find the massive treasure of Haddock's ancestor. What I liked about the animation is that it is very similar to the Polar Express and lifelike. I also liked how the story has many twists and turns to keep you on your toes and that you cannot predict what is going to happen next. What I liked about Tintin is I thought the 3D was amazing and the depth was tremendous and I think it is worth the extra money to go see it in 3D. I think that you will enjoy Tintin and think it's a fun-filled ride. Boy, I gotta admit, Tintin is a fantastic film. Colin, was there any part of the movie which you did not like? Well, some parts it was kind of slow. Seriously? Slow? I thought it was a thrilling animated film. So overall, I give this film an A. I give this film an A minus. Hold it, Colin. We still have one more film to review. Steven Spielberg's War Horse. Now for our next movie review. War Horse is our second Steven Spielberg feature film. And it's an incredible story. It's about a farm boy named Albert Narcott, whose cherished horse, Joey, is sold to the British troops for World War I. Albert later enrolls in the army to find his horse and searches across Europe on a quest to be reunited with his steadfast companion. The great thing about seeing two Steven Spielberg movies back to back is that you know they're going to be great. And War Horse is a fantastic film. He really brings on the drama with a fantastic story. I admit, it's a long film, 2 hours and 26 minutes, but it's worth every minute to see this movie. War Horse is a wonderful film and has a very emotional story, but what I didn't like about it is I'm more a person that likes happy, more lighthearted films rather than the sad and dramatic films. And I also didn't like that at the beginning when they're introducing on how the boy and the horse met, how slow it was. Colin, I have to agree with you. There are a lot of depressing parts in the film, but parents should show some minor concern, because although there is no, little to no swearing, and there is no mention of sex, the violence in this movie is actually pretty strong, so I would not recommend it to anyone under the age of 14. Corey, I gotta agree, the violence in this film is very graphic. Okay then, let's get to our ratings. Overall, I give War Horse an A-. I give War Horse a B plus. Wow, I gotta admit, we came pretty close in our rings in this movie. One more thing, we gotta thank Steven Spielberg for releasing two great films this holiday season. So from two teens and the movie, we'll see, see you, you next time. time. Jeez.